Are you, are you singing love? Are you singing? You were singing in the rain. You were singing in the rain, love. Do you want Starbucks? I don't mind, it's all good. I'm I don't mind it because I don't want to drink a coffee that costs 300 pesos where I can buy 50 somewhere else. Nah, it's not 300 pesos, relax. Come on, let's go to Starbucks. See, they're so cheap, the Filipino girls. Like, they're so cheap. It's not even that money. She doesn't even buy it. I'm going to buy it. She's so cheap, mate. It's just, that's normal for us, right? Anyway. So I'm escalating with this guy, right? So he 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 messages me, blah blah. You should take the back seat, let you go off and talk. So last time I was in the back seat, it was with your mother, bro. And he's like, relax, brother. He goes, relax and watch the watch the footy on the telly. He said, watch the footy on the telly. I said, last thing on my telly was your mum when I bent her over over the telly, mate. So I'm kind of going to war with this along the way. Like, I don't mind a bit of a bit of a like a comments biff if it's Sunday, mate. If I'm not working, if it's a work day, I just don't have time for it. But if it's Sunday afternoon, we're walking around goofing off oh, I don't mind a bit of a well, I go straight for their mum mate go straight for your mum because um, you know what are you gonna say oh what's the footy I'm calling your mum a whore brother I'm calling your mum a whore and you're telling me to watch the footy relax brother hey I love the apron very sexy brother so Jessica's honey dicking me right now so there's a reason why we can't leave the province but the, I don't know we why, why are we still in the province you're you honey dicking me, love. You just said we need to plan. We can't just leave. You're a honey dicker. Of course no, we can. We can just leave. No, we can't. We need to know. You want to go to Baraka. We need to, I don't know how to get there. You need to get on a boat. You need to get on a boat. I don't know. You think we're going to have a signal there and be able to search, hey, where am I going? The signal there is shit. In Baraka, right? Yes. Is that true? Yes. Search it. Are you sure? Yeah, search it. The internet's not good there. Yes, it's an island here. What do you expect? Uh, so that's a problem because we have to work. We have to work. Check, check. Yeah, that's a problem. But I heard that that's bad there. It's bad there. It's been, always been a problem. The, the internet? Because El Nido. When we went to El Nido, the internet was shit in El Nido as well. I had the Philippines, mate. What was that? I I mean, you're whiter than dark chocolate. Not quite as white as milk chocolate. There's somewhere in between dark chocolate and milk chocolate. Definitely erring towards the milk chocolate side, right? Yeah. So where are we going now? I don't know. Starbucks. Oh, do you want to go to Starbucks? I think I drink. Okay, let's go to Starbucks. Let's go to Starbucks. Let's go to Starbucks. It's so expensive. Oh, I'm sure we can afford a bit of Starbucks. So. This dude, right? He's been putting me in comments. They put him in comment. Like blah blah, blah. and he's a professor right, at a community college, and I was like, so oh, mate, I fully stalked this guy. I went, um, I found out like his LinkedIn, like I uh, went through, you know, I found out where he works, all this kind of stuff, and I was like, brother, you're a vocational trainer with a PhD, like, and it, I mean he's Jewish, so I was like, do you think you achieve? Do you think, 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 um, your parents are sitting around going, oh, we're so proud of John. He's a vocational trainer, he did a PhD, and he's a vocational trainer at a community college in America. Um, so I was really, I really went pretty hard in, right? And um, I was like, I was like, I hope you have siblings, because he's Jewish, right? So there's always that, there's Jews, right? There's always this thing of like, they're always saying, oh, my son does this, my son does this. I have a lot of French Jews, clients Jews. I lived in Israel. I love the Jews, right? But I understand that psyche, right? So it's always like, you're not good enough, especially if you're not a doctor. Anyway, so, I was saying, oh, John, John, you, um, like, you, well, your parents are saying, oh, you, I hope your parents have other kids so they, they can, like, get some face back because you're a break. You, what do you want, 40K? You're a vocational trainer at a, uh, at a college. He's got a PhD. Anyway, um, I went really pretty hard on him, right? And he said, oh, you know, you, you're absolutely right in everything he said because he doesn't want, he doesn't want co confrontation. But I'm like, jab's thrown, brother. Jab's have been thrown, brother. It's time. Confrontation has started, brother. You've already started. Like, yeah, I've done the research. It's time to... Time to, time to punch on, mate, you know, like, proverbially in the comment section. Anyway, he doesn't want anything. So the girl sends his comment, right? And she's like, oh, um, she's like, oh, um, you know, Jessica shouldn't show a cleavage. And I was like, listen, what are you doing? You're haram, mate. You're, I, again, I've researched her. She's a good person. You're haram, like, um, you're basically uh, clicking on this. I go, your internet search history must be shocking. Clean it now, you know. You're haram. You need to pray, mate. Don't click on 
click on the, like my thumbnails. You need to pray, mate. You need to say some prayers, you know? Uh, not be so haram. Anyway, so I try and get the psyche of the commoner where we go these things. I really enjoy dealing with these commoners, just because I like it so much, but if I've got time, like I'm at a dentist or whatever, I'll respond to mean comments. Like, um, I really enjoy it, mate. I really have a great time with it. So yeah, there you go. So, my ex-wife worked in this kindy, and um, and they they were talking about, like, uh, I think they were talking about, like, someone was talking about penises or something like that. And this girl said, my, my mum has a penis, right? And they went, oh, I don't think your mum has a penis. And she said, no, no, she has a penis. She said, no, no, no. She said, it's black. And she keeps it in her, next to her bed. <laughs> in the kindy, mate, kindy. My mum has a penis. She just pipes up with it. I think they were talking about penises. I think this kid just piped up with, this kid just pipes up and says, my mum has a penis. So Jessica keeps a bat next to her bed. Right, love, do you keep a bat next to your bed? Mm. Tell the you. truth, love, tell the truth. I keep you. Oh. <laughs> See, that is an influence that I'm like a baton, brother. I'm like a baton. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Mine's warm and alive. <sighs> and white. Right. And wrinkly. <laughs> it's a joke. Not on a warm night. No. It's a joke. They also have those. Love, okay, listen, listen, love, love, listen. Yeah. Listen. If you had, you could go back and reconstruct your dating profile, should be like this. I'm pretty, but I live in the second coldest city in the Philippines, and I like country music. I like country music, right? I didn't say about the Yeah, that, yeah but, but you, you didn't disguise you like country music. And I constantly watch crime dramas 24 seven. So, so Jessica, let me tell you about Jessica, right? One coldest city, constantly watching crime dramas like it just it drives me crazy like everyone's killing everyone i know she's watching something i'm like oh i bet she murders him you know like um constantly watching crime dramas and she loves country music she's bloody filipino mate how does she like country music who's your favorite country music guy who do we listen to i'll say luke combs luke combs Holmes or combs Holmes, like luke combs and what does he sing huh what does he sing uh, he sings uh, uh, songs about his life and his experience. It's pretty funny. He's a good singer. I like him. Do you prefer He's country? A big guy. A big, like, a big. Yeah, I understand. A type of choice, right? Do you prefer country music to gangster rap? Absolutely. Would you choose Luke Holmes to listen to over Tupac? Yes, absolutely. Right. He's choosing Luke Holmes. No. He's dead for a reason. Yeah, he's dead because he's an OG, bro. He's a gangster. He's a gangster. Hey, hi, Jess. Are you going to Thailand? Sure. We should go to Thailand, love. Yes. Love, I'm going to be over the Philippines. It's bloody raining all the time. Wet season. Maybe we should trip off to Thailand, love. All right, here we are, Burger King. Although Burger King's so much cheaper here than Thailand, right? Like, way cheaper. So half the price, a third of the price of Thailand. Last time I was here, I ordered a double burger and just got me two burgers. Uh, Whopper, Whopper meal. Whopper meal, love, I'm such a large. Am I in the land of the little people? Look at my drink. That's good though, potato things. There's no Whopper. There's no power, there's no power. You got a double. Which whole meal? Whole meal's $12 Australian. It's like $9 you uh, American. This is Starbucks. So check it out. Oh, this is good, bro. This is good. All oh, these sausages, bro. Pig in a bun. Danishes. Cookies. Those donuts. Bro, this looks gangster. Oh, I've got to look at the menu. I've been to me because the guy's like, just for a while. And I was like, for a while, what? He's like, oh, for a while. I said, what do, you, what do you mean? I just want a menu. But he's serving someone. Okay. Everyone's laughing because I don't, I don't, I don't speak Tagalog, obviously. But everyone speaks good English here. And it, anyway, he gave me this menu. Oh, what do you want? He let me take it. Because I'm a foreigner. I've got white privilege, brother. There is white privilege in the Philippines, by the way. It's Very massive. Caramel looks good. Love, the cakes are good. They've got pies. They've they got all kinds of stuff. They have New York cheesecake. 
Huh? I have new. Yeah, 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 whatever you want. I don't want it. It's for you. So this is a. Uh, I wonder if there's any foreigners coming here in the day, love. Yeah, I think so. Build a little network of foreigners, brother, and the coffee there's shop. There's actually a coffee shop back there. Yeah. It's not Starbucks, but I've been there once. Starbucks. Check it out. A Java Whip coffee. Whose soy boys are drinking soy soy milk? I know I actually seen that soy milk in a. I also want to try the ice American. Mate, no, he's drinking soy milk in um, like in um, in Lipa. He's drinking soy milk in Lipa. Like, come on, mate. But, what about chai tea, love? Oh, it's ice. Yeah. So I had some chai tea in India. It was good. What is it? What's yours? I think after me. Diabetes, here I come. It's actually not my drink, but it's named after me. Is what? It's named after me. Is that mine? No, it is yours. Now, this is yours. Man, that tastes good. Good or not? Yeah. <laughs> Just cut, that's me. You try. Mine, is good, Mine tastes like hope and rainbows. <laughs> ah. I don't like coffee. Ah. Yuck, that's horrible. The coffee's so bitter, I never understand how people like it. People are like, well, oh, bro, you drink beer, beer's bitter. Beer gets you laid, bro. Like, coffee doesn't get you laid. Relax. I find coffee a bit better. Why would I corrupt my drink, which is caramel, caramel bloody rainbows and awesomeness, right? With your drink, which is coffee, which is bitter. Young love, look at this young, young love. TikTok suggestion. Well, TikTok also suggests people cut the pieces off, right? And dudes become girls, so I'm not too keen on that, right? Starbucks, and this is a mountain province. We're in the second coldest city in the Philippines, so it's the second highest mountain province. After Baguio, Lipa City is the highest mountain province. And this is my mountain girl, Lovey. Say hi, mountain girl. Starby. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Love, what's the highlight of growing up in the mountain? Uh, Was it harvest? Yeah. Tell harvest me about harvest, love. Harvest. I used to harvest right with my with my parents, my cousins, my uncles. What did you harvest? So the whole family, like corn, rice, and the main. There's caramel under, underneath. You have to shake it. And um, yeah, but usually corn and rice. No, I don't do rice. I do. What about potatoes? You don't grow potatoes? Why don't you grow potatoes? We do sweet potatoes. Yeah. I, I love that. I used to steal. Why don't them. you do the non terrorist option? Yeah, we like do real that. potatoes. We do that, and then my grandpa I used to steal them from my grandpa. Like when I'm hungry, right? I just gonna just because you have to dig it under from under the thing, right? And then he's got a store, and then the potatoes overlooking the potato uh, farm is overlooking his store. So well, real potatoes or sweet potatoes? Sweet every time so sometimes I go there like in the afternoon when, when it's almost Speak dark yeah. Yeah, you got it. it's almost dark so I can just dip the, the potatoes and he won't see me but then he's got this um it's like a batter batter Bat, yeah. and every time he sees me digging look Jesse that's you again what are you doing I told you leave it because they're still small is that the baton you keep next to your bed no she didn't really have a bat next to her bed. <laughs> so Starbucks pretty good. I thought I'd come. No, I don't like coffee though. I don't like coffee. Coffee's a terrorist. I'm gonna have such bad stomach. Really? Why would you drink it then? Gee, this is all about Filipinos. Love, I go a bit crazy in the province. There's... Do you know people 
buy those mugs and collect them. The what? They collect those, uh, what do they call it? Tumblr. Well, these things? They're pretty expensive, yeah. Wow. So, like, you know how we call those people in Australia? Dorks. We call them nerds and dorks. He buys, oh, I collect Starbucks cups. Next. Swipe left. So guys, please subscribe, share if you like, and hit the notification button so you're always updated with our vlogs. And see you in the next vlog. Bye. Oh, don't subscribe. I can really care less.